Low transmission fluid can cause a range of problems that are both costly and frustrating. In this video, we'll go over the symptoms of low transmission fluid so you can identify them early and prevent any damage to your car. Automatic transmission fluid, or ATF, serves several essential functions in the vehicle's transmission system. ATF acts as a lubricant for the gears, bearings, and other moving parts in the transmission, helping to reduce friction and wear on these components. Additionally, ATF serves as a hydraulic fluid that creates pressure within the transmission to engage and disengage gears and clutches. It also helps to regulate the transmission's temperature and protect it against rust and corrosion. The location of the transmission fluid level dipstick varies depending on the make and model of the vehicle. In most vehicles, the transmission fluid dipstick is located underneath the hood. However, some newer vehicles don't have a dipstick to check the fluid level. For example, my Ford Fusion has an oil leveling plug hole on the side of the transmission. In simple terms, the fluid level needs to be even with the plug hole. If it's not, your car is low on fluid. If you're not sure where to locate the plug hole in your vehicle, I would recommend using a repair manual. I'll leave the one that I use in the description below. It's also important to note that some manufacturers require a special procedure or tool in order to check the fluid level. The first symptom is shifting problems. Low transmission fluid levels can make it difficult to shift gears or cause your car to slip out of gear while driving. If the transmission fluid level is low, there may not be enough lubrication, causing increased friction and heat within the transmission. The increased friction can cause the gears to grind against each other, making it difficult to shift gears smoothly or causing them to slip out of gear altogether. The transmission system also may not be able to create enough hydraulic pressure, causing difficulty in shifting gears. The second symptom is unusual noises. A lack of lubrication can cause parts from the transmission to grind or whine, which can be heard from the inside of the car. The third symptom is the transmission overheating. As the transmission's parts rub against each other without enough ATF to lubricate them, they create more friction. Friction generates heat, which can damage the transmission's internal components, including the clutches, gears, and bearings. The next symptom is a burning smell. Since low transmission fluid levels can overheat the transmission, it will cause the burning smell that may be noticeable inside of the car. The fifth symptom is warning lights. This depends on the make and model of the vehicle. Some vehicles have a dedicated transmission warning light that illuminates when the fluid level is low or when the fluid is overheating. In contrast, other vehicles may have an engine warning light that activates when the transmission fluid is low as the engine control module communicates with the transmission control module. Now low fluid isn't the only thing that can cause problems with your transmission, this part right here can too. 